hello welcome back to another episode of urban hospitality i'm your host Ms. lola o ty is um joining will be joining us later she's at home preparing the house i'm actually here at our local grocery store called fresh grocer here in west philly um, university city right next to university of penn and i'm going to be meeting up with our guest pietro aka peter from italy he's going to be teaching me how to teach an off uh, cook an authentic Italian dish, so I'm really excited. So you guys can um, follow along with us. We're gonna um, pick up the ingredients here, and then head back home and start cooking. Um, I'm, I'm a little bit hungry, so I'm gonna actually go across the street to the Panera Bridge. Don't tell anyone, and pick up something really quickly, and then I'll meet Peter, uh, Pietro in the uh, the lobby in about in about 15 minutes. So I'll pull you guys back up once he arrives. All right, stay tuned. Wow. All right, guys. I'm back with Pietro Peter. Hi. Hi. So we're gonna be picking out the ingredients for tonight's dinner. What are we having for tonight? Uh, I think we may have some scallopini with mushrooms. Ooh. And maybe a first dish is uh, we have to see which kind of pasta. Okay. Uh, well, I'm looking forward to it. All right, so <laughs> come follow us as we go grocery shopping for our ingredients. Mm. Looking for mushrooms right here. Yeah, right here. Perfect. Around, show them the mushrooms. Oh. Can turn it with this. Ah, you can. Okay. So I think we could, can use the white one. Okay. Uh, we can either take package maybe. This one to the cookie. Okay. Nice. Mushrooms. Okay. Now we look for our scallopine. The scallopina may be prepared with three kinds of meat. Huh? With veal, with pork, or with uh, chicken. I like quite a lot the pork one. Uh, the veal one are more uh, sophisticated. <laughs> but usually I don't think they are worth it at a cost. You know I was Muslim, I don't eat pork. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, mm, I, I quite remember you were Christian. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if well, man, someone can have um, two religions. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That would be strange. <laughs> that would be strange. Okay, pork it is. Pork here it is. I think something like this. Let's look about it. Oh, can you take the kidneys? So we're kidding the pork chops. I haven't had pork chops look in so for long. For pork, not too, too fat. Not too fat. Yeah, exactly. Um, so lean pork chop. Yeah, but this seems. Yeah, because the sister's trying to lose weight, so we don't want any fat pork. pork we have. Oh, I think what about that one? This one seems a little less fat than the other than the others. Okay. We are four, so we have one more scallop. Okay. Dana, how much is this? $4.36. That's a good price. You want to get two? No, no I want. Yeah, I was wondering if one two. But since Let's we have two, because we can at least get two pieces each. Yeah, that's true. Okay. We should take two. Okay. <laughs> what do you want to eat? A meal that uh, your dad uh, wants you finished, <laughs> or a meal in which you still have some energy? Some energy, stuff. some okay. energy. This so like, this, <laughs> take just one. Okay. okay, and for the pasta, I think we have three alternatives that we're thinking about. We may have a, a typical one with sausages and broccoli. Okay. So it's something I really like, the kind of pasta. It's easy, but of a, of a fact. Okay. Or we may try to do the um, amatrechana pasta, Ooh. which is with bacon, tomato sauce, and onions, principally. That sounds good. We want to try the amatrechana pasta? Yes. Okay. <laughs> so let's go find some bacon. Excuse me. All right, we're looking for. What are we looking for? Bacon? Wasn't there? Um, I don't know actually. I think it might be on the other end. We can ask them though. No, okay. I thought it was near the pan. Oh, here it is. Not. It's there's some turkey bacon and beef no, bacon. I don't want the pork bacon. Neither the beef bacon. But I bacon. think I want the pork bacon. Where will you guys have pork bacon? Pork bacon. Oh, okay. Oh, we, where we just were. <laughs> we must have just passed it. <laughs> 
Oh, they have the pork bacon far from the beef bacon <laughs> and the turkey bacon. I know, that's weird, huh? Yeah, this place is really weird. <laughs> Institution of stuff. You say, yeah, ah. th that's why I don't like coming to the grocery stores. Yeah. It's organized eclectically. This is especially organized spring. Is it near the Yeah. Okay, found it. Yeah, there, there is more oh. This is something different. In Italy we only have like one kind of bacon. They don't have pork bacon? Yeah, they have a lot of pork bacon. Oh, this seems to, to be pork bacon, right? Oh, okay. I don't usually eat but you bacon, have a... so... Ah, okay. But this I'm going to eat it tonight. But here there are a lot of different kinds, like... I think they this have seems good. Do you have, are you celiac? No. We have celiac. So I think we can take this. It okay. seems quite a lot. But I can use it. We can prepare a carbonara for pasta another time. Okay. Okay. Sounds like a plan. Now we have to find some tomato. Okay, tomatoes will be back over here. Uh, not fresh tomato, the canned tomatoes. Oh, the canned tomatoes. And okay, I think that will be. Down this aisle. I'm becoming possible in this place. Oh, drive pasta spaghetti. Oh, it's Al two. Al two. We have a tomato paste. It's really strange that you have spam because for us spam is just the mail you don't want to receive. <laughs> it really isn't popular here either. I don't know yeah, why. You know So we're gonna get ready to check out and we'll pull you guys back up when we get back to the house. Thank you for joining us on our shopping excursion. We'll meet you guys back in the kitchen. Okay, welcome back. We're home. Um, oh, perfect timing. Guess who got here at the exact same time that I got here? Peter. <laughs> That is like the best timing. Like I literally just got here. Really? Yes. I was in the back oh. trying to enter, but I couldn't enter with the oh, key. Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot to tell you that that key doesn't work to the back door. Oh, I hope that's so <laughs> I'm much. sorry. We're too that was a bit of that. information I probably should have told him. <laughs> All right, so we we're in too hoping that because it was a body who trying to enter the house. Oh, he's entering. Let's come with him. Buddy was trying to get in the house too. Sorry, yeah. buddy. <laughs> okay, let me let me. Okay. So he's gonna come back and help me with the bags. I don't have that many bags, so it's not like he needs to. But we have another gentleman staying with us. Italian gentleman. Hmm. Who knew? Out of the car. There we go. All right, so I'm just grabbing the groceries. As you can obviously see, poor lighting right there. Sorry, can't see my face. Um, come on. I'm actually glad he's coming to help me because I kind of discombobulated because I have my my purse in one hand and. I can walk around and get the other grocery bag. Alrighty. Let's get the chopping. So how long were you in the back? Not that long. No, not that long. Okay. One, two minutes. I realized that my keys couldn't <laughs> open it and I came on this side. Okay. Yeah, but yeah. Look who's home. Say hi. Hi, buddy. 
but he came into. He wants to eat some Italian tonight as well. All right, so we're going to get ready yes. to cook. So I'm going to set you guys up over here so you guys can see everything that we're doing. Wash our hands. If my camera will work with me. So I'm going to um, do, I told Pietro that I only want to do what's easy. Um, so the easiest thing is obviously chopping. So I'm going to chop some mushrooms. Yeah. So bro, Pietro is washing them off. Um, and yeah. as he's washing them off, I'll just be chopping them. How should I chop them? Like, is any, is there a preference or? Yeah, by the way, them? yeah, I will show you. Yeah, maybe we don't need all the mushrooms. Okay, just a few. Good way to cook the mushrooms that are good for a lot of uh, dishes, or just to eat like themselves. Okay. In Italian, this way of cooking the mushrooms is say terricolare. Terricolare. What does that mean? It's mushrooms. It's the word just for mushrooms. Oh. The mushrooms terricolati are the mushrooms cooked with. Uh, Oil, parsley, and garlic. Oh, that sounds delicious. Yeah, they're good. They're quite good. Yeah, no, the better way to chop them okay. is to start cutting the, um, let's see, this part. The core? Yeah. Okay. Like this in a, because this part is a little, um, has a fiber in it. Okay. So you want to cut uh, all the fiber so it's softer in your mouth. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Yeah, then we stop it, you chop like the one okay. that you're doing. So cut okay. this first and then... Yeah, exactly. Cut in little slices. Okay. And then you cut... Uh, yeah. Okay, I will proceed... Okay, the first things, I will heat the water for the pasta. Okay. It's important the water is very much. Very hot. Very much. You want, very to, much. You want a lot of water. A lot of water. Um, are you still chopping anything? Yeah, I just, well, yeah, I wanted to film a little bit of the Okay. Okay. So here's the bacon simmering. Mmm. Yeah. I'm not really a big bacon eater, but I think I'm going to like this one. And here's okay. my mushrooms. Yeah, chop them. Now we'll put all the mushrooms in a pan with the... Um... You know, he's really cooking this dish. I'm just kind of his assistant. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's an assistant, but even a documentary director, director how you say? You're directing? Yeah, exactly. Do we need any seasoning? Any seasoning? For the moment, no. But fresh herbs mm -hmm. like thyme, rosemary, we'll use both parsley and thyme in these recipes. Okay. But we will not use that much, apart from pepper. We use a lot of pepper. A lot of pepper. Yeah. I would imagine you guys grow a lot of your own like vegetables, right? Yeah, exactly. We use fresh vegetables, vegetables a lot. So would, would you say like every household has like their own private garden? Or no. not every household? A lot of places, uh, have, a lot of houses have their own, uh, or even on the balcony, on the how do you call this place on the window? Fish, the, the I, I want to say terrorist, but it's not the terrorist. Okay, we have to put some olive oil in the mushrooms. Okay. Yeah. Buddy smelling bacon. <laughs> I was like, what you guys cooking in here? You're gonna join us for dinner, buddy. You wanna say hi to our guests? Say hi. Say hi. Bring them down low. Say hi. This is gonna be joining us for our Italian dish dinner tonight. He's really excited, can't you tell? <laughs> can't you tell? I'm guiding his face. Don't oh. move. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> like he's paying attention. You don't need that. Don't talk about my cat like that. <laughs> he like. Yeah, you know, he's like, I'm gonna eat this. Yeah, 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 I'm
you like, I'm ready for this. No, he wanted me to put down. He doesn't like me to but I sneak in my clothes. All right. Let me wash my okay. hands. Okay. <laughs> uh, just put the we typically eat this for breakfast. You guys eat bacon for breakfast? No. No? That would be something crazy for an Italian. Oh, really? Right? But, yeah, you, Why? you only, almost only eat sweet things for breakfast. Sweet things for breakfast? Yeah. Now, that seems. That's my breakfast. kind of breakfast. <laughs> what? That That's sounds nice. like a. That, that also kind of sounds like American breakfast. We like to eat sweet cereal. Eat some eat sweet cereals in the milk. Some, like me, I usually eat uh, tea and biscuits. Mm -hmm. Or some do like bread, butter, and jam. Okay. Or bread and Nutella. Bread and Nutella? Yeah. Or the right. typical breakfast if you are outside. Okay, so Peter is going to show me how to make the, the pork chop. So we didn't have a beat a beater. Exactly. <laughs> we don't have a beater, but we so found a, a we, perfect substance. We became creative. <laughs> and we're using a can my candle, my handy candle. <laughs> Isn't that urban? Urban hospitality. That's why we're called urban hospitality. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna see how this is gonna go. Oh, I just want to eat that. No, you have to wait for the pasta and for the sauce. Oh my gosh, I can't <laughs> wait. <laughs> it's so good. Look at that. Mushrooms. Mm. Okay, now it will be a little more. Don't you wish you was in my house? Really that. <laughs> yeah, I'm so you gotta do each one of those like that. Yeah, exactly. It's not like torture. <laughs> yeah, but it's sort of already dead pork, so. Oh my god. Yeah, if you I have would, a... I would imagine this would be a great stress reliever. What? <laughs> imagine this would be a great stress reliever. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> You had a bad day at work, you come home and... Then you had another candle and you started beating <laughs> some pork chops. Wow. Yeah, I didn't beat that much, but I'm frightened that if I beat too much... Yeah. Mushrooms are almost cooked, but we needed to add a little bit more water to okay. cook them much better. And also we need to put some salt in it. Salt? So I can yeah. do that. Ah, this is ready that. for the tomato sauce, actually. Here we go. Oh! oh. Mm. Okay, so can I pour the tomato sauce in? Yeah, put half of the tomato sauce for the moment. Okay, just half. And we need and some salt. Like that much? Yeah, it seems good to me. Okay. Am I stirring? What? Am I stirring? Yeah, you have to do the slightly different things with the fork. Okay. You see, we put. Uh, the whole tomato that usually are the better. It's really an art. <laughs> yeah. Do you want to do it? Yeah, I'll try. 
so that is so okay let me just show you guys what a pro pietro is at cutting look at this <laughs> this is amazing <laughs> Yeah, I just wanted to show you guys. I have a real chef in the house. <laughs> so that's the parsley and the garlic that we're going to add to the pork chops. We are sitting down to have our first um, of three a three course two course dinner so we we started off with the pasta which in italy is called italian say it again amatriciana oh my god i want to try it but i don't want to butcher it do you want to try to pronounce that amatriciana oh amatriciana yeah and it comes from this little town of amatrice Oh, I'm a Amatrice. Amatrice. Okay. Amatrice. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. So he's, something that I should not hear. <laughs> he's running back into the kitchen to save the remaining dish. So we're going to have the main course, which is a pork chop um, over with, with um, mushrooms. mushrooms and parsley and garlic. It's really good. Is it good? I'm yeah, happy with this. It's very flavorful. We're almost done. Okay. I really want to warm this up because I want to get the rest of the Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to warm her dish up. Please come, Lola and Nitty. Okay, okay. It's okay, already I'm too coming. cold. You should need to. <laughs> experienced these flavors before and it's it was during a ship in inspection and they it's a ship you go on and you kind of figure out if you want to buy one of their cruises and they gave, give you food and so in this ship cruise they gave us a, a bowl of pasta and it was like like I still remember it to this day and that oh my like, god I'm so happy <laughs> <laughs> one of my I was like Wow. I was like, this is it was really simple. Yes. But it was like you wanna record me sampling. Sure. Okay. Is it on? Mm-hmm. Alright. Dig it in. Oh my god. <laughs> I know you wish you were here sampling, but it's sorry. This is amazing. This will not, I'm not taking any of this to lunch tomorrow. Why? I'm going to eat everything. No, you're not. You should try the pork chops before and then you decide with which you want no. to do the. No. <laughs> this is so good. Oh my gosh. I'm so glad I had this recorded because now we can actually make it again. Mm -hmm. And you see, it was not that hard to do. Who was it? But the important thing is that the all the ingredients are well cooked. Yeah. You have to well cook before the bacon alone. Mm -hmm. Then add the onions. When the onions is a little cooked, you add the tomato and uh, make it cook for at least one, 10 minutes with 10 to minutes. Okay. It's all of those smaller decisions about, yeah, exactly. about timing that really make the difference. Yeah. And I, I had a lot of bad um, <laughs> about China prepared, like with the onions too, too raw, raw or the bacon too raw. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So you were, you've been able to perfect it over time. Or to, yeah. So how did you first learn how to make this dish? Was it someone showed you or you ate it and you were like, ooh, I want to... There's something quite famous. I think my... My parents did, did that mm -hmm. at my house, 
And then I perfectioned it when um, I went away to study. Okay. And you had, I had time to, book to cook my own to perfect it while you were studying. Yeah, mm-hmm. when I was studying in the evening or stuff at that time. Cool. cool. We don't have time to cook. <laughs> Mm-hmm. That's crazy. The I just you find time to cook. I, I just don't remember day. cooking in college. <laughs> I don't either. Where do you want to put this? Also, it's a social experience in college in Italy cooking. <laughs> you you. One slice of meat each, and then we can divide the remaining two slices. Is this um? Is this it's all the same? Pina. It's a French. It's a, it was originally a French thing called escalope, but in like the, like the seafood scallop. No, 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 no. Escalope. Yeah, and escalope. it's just some meat. Look at buddy. In, um, <laughs> he wants to go out. Flour with usually some alcoholic around it. There are uh, or something else. So uh, in, in oil and butter. Oh, okay. I, I will provide a, a knife for everybody, maybe it's better. Um, pasta. I know. Is there any more pasta left? I want some yeah, for yeah, lunch. Yeah, there is more pasta left. <laughs> okay. Like, uh, half of the pasta is left. Okay. <laughs> I think we good. have a lunch also for tomorrow. Yes. Oh my gosh. Oh, no, my, co-workers. my co-workers. <laughs> they going be mad. They're going to hate us. <laughs> They're like, uh, what? You had an Italian you know, cookie. Like you. Off. Bon appetito. <laughs> bon appetito. Almost there. Almost there. <laughs> Not quite. We'll give you a C. <laughs> a C. <laughs> Just a C. Oh, man. I'm failing, y'all. I'm failing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. I'll take a B minus. <laughs> oh, my mother would be very disappointed. Excuse me. Now that Pietro has rated me on my Italian, I'm gonna rate him on his food, um, and I'm gonna give him an A plus. <laughs> oh man, this is so good. This is so good. As we like to say here in America. This is lit. This is really lit. How do you say? This is lit. This is lit. What is this? Lit. With an T. L-I-T. L-I-T. Yeah. L-I-T. I mean, really, really, really good. It's a Philadelphia okay. slang. slang. I will use it. Ah, it's a Philadelphia slang. <laughs> okay. So when I come back to Italy to make my right. oh. I've been to Philadelphia, <laughs> I will say, say this is lit. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, that's a B, that's a B, that's a B plus, a B plus.